In the heart of the French Riviera, the Principality of Monaco stands as a beacon of opulence, glamour, and intrigue. Central to Monaco's rich history is the enigmatic Grimaldi family, whose lineage has been marred by tales of a curse that has cast a shadow over their every move. Beyond the glitz and glamour lies a narrative of misfortune, tragedy, and the inexplicable, as we delve into the depths of the curse that has haunted the Grimaldi dynasty for centuries. The Genesis of the Curse To comprehend the mystique surrounding the Grimaldi curse, one must journey back to the 13th century. The origin story unfolds with Francois Grimaldi, a man who, in a daring feat, disguised himself as a monk to seize control of the fortress of Monaco. The deceitful act, it is said, triggered a curse that would reverberate through generations. Legend has it that the curse was a consequence of sacrilege, a punishment for violating the sanctity of the monastery in the relentless pursuit of power. The curse tapestry unfurls. Through the annals of history, the Grimaldi family faced myriad challenges that some attribute to the ancient curse. From political upheavals to financial crises, the family weathered storms that tested their resilience. A pivotal moment arrived during the tumultuous days of the French Revolution, when Monaco fell under French control, stripping the Grimaldis of their sovereignty. The subsequent struggles and hardships endured by the family fueled the narrative of a curse that seemed inexorably tied to their fate. Tragedy strikes close to home. While geopolitical events shaped the fate of Monaco, the Grimaldi family's personal tragedies became more pronounced, solidifying the belief in the curse. The most poignant example is the untimely death of Princess Grace in a car accident in 1982, a devastating blow that echoed through the corridors of the palace and fueled speculation about the malevolent influence of the curse. The loss of Princess Grace, beloved by the people of Monaco, was a stark reminder of the fragility of life and the enduring grip of the curse. The next generation, represented by Prince Albert II, faced its own set of challenges and controversies, further amplifying the notion that an ancient curse continued to plague the Grimaldi dynasty. The weight of personal tribulation seemed to magnify the whispers of a supernatural force dictating the family's destiny. Attempts to unshackle from the curse, desperate to break free from the perceived curse, the Grimaldi family undertook various rituals and symbolic gestures. Religious ceremonies sought solace and protection against the malevolent forces that supposedly haunted them. Yet the persistence of misfortune in the family's history left many wondering whether these attempts were futile, or if the curse was an indomitable force with a will of its own. Skepticism and Alternative Explanations Amidst the tales of curses and supernatural afflictions, Skeptics argue that the Grimaldi family's misfortunes can be explained by the challenges inherent in maintaining power and prestige over the centuries. Political intrigues, rivalries, and the precarious nature of monarchies provide a more pragmatic lens through which to view the family's struggles. In this interpretation, the Grimaldis become victims of the complex tapestry of historical events rather than a supernatural hex. Conclusion as the Principality of Monaco strides forward into an uncertain future, the question of whether the Grimaldi family can ever escape the clutches of the ancient curse remains unanswered. The intersection of history, folklore, and the supernatural continues to captivate those intrigued by the enigmatic tale of the Grimaldi curse. Will time prove to be a healer or a perpetuator of the family's woes? Only the unfolding chapters of Monaco's history will unveil the ultimate destiny of the Grimaldi family as they grapple with the echoes of a curse that refuses to be silenced.